Hey guys, <coughs> Addison here with some Dishonored gameplay. So Dishonored is a game that came out in uh, 2012. It was debuted at E3. It is published by Bethesda Softworks and was developed by Arcane. So this D Dishonored is a stealth assassin game. It's first person. And um, yeah, you are a you are tasked as Corvo who was the bodyguard to the queen, framed for her murder, you gain supernatural abilities and have to kind of clear your name. So, uh, yeah, I think we're gonna do one mission. This might be a longer video, but, uh, yeah, we'll see. So you can select this. I have supernatural abilities. I can sneak around. I can teleport. Deactivate the checkpoint spotlights. Okay. I can also jump really high because I've upgraded my jump. Okay, yeah, I got it. And basically, you can. This is dark vision. It allows you to see people through walls. You have your mana and uh, health at the top there. And usually in Dust Hunter, there's two things as you can go. You can either go non-lethal, like choking people out, and like hiding their bodies, Citizens or you can go uh, like random By killing and just stab everyone. The curfew is now active. No foot traffic is allowed across Altman's Bridge until curfew is lifted. <coughs> Attention all citizens. No pedestrian movement is allowed along Caldwin's Bridge during this period. Curfew will end tomorrow morning at sunrise. So this is kind of a sneaky, sneaky game. You're gonna wanna... People will... Everyone hates you, basically. Everyone will try to kill you. And there's the rat plague, which is carried by rats and it's pretty bad for you, just generally. You can also get things for coins, which you can buy stuff with. And normally, rats aren't that big a deal, but if you see a big swarm of them, like 20 or 30, then they will come after you and they will kill you. So right now, I'm just kind of... Ooh, warehouse key will come in handy. Uh, so... What I'm going to do is I'm going to try to get over those spotlights without anyone seeing me. So far, no one has seen me yet. And, uh... Yeah, these missions, usually when you're trying to be sneaky, they take a little bit longer than if you just try to run through and kill everybody. So this might be a longer video. How do I get out of here? What's going on? And this game is very pretty though, like, just the general art style, it looks very nice. It's very steampunky. Let's see, where am I trying to go? I'm going over here. These are whale oil tanks, which are used to do stuff. Oh, that's gonna hurt me. Okay, no. These things blow up and they also use to fuel everything. This is very loud and... Ow! I got hurt by... I guess the electricity. Yeah, that thing. That's, don't want to step on that. But, uh... Oh, I should have been in that when, it, when I sent it over. I'm back over, Kurt. It's part puzzle game, like you're gonna have to figure out different ways to do stuff. But at its heart, it's a stealth game. Okay, so 
I'm gonna do that. Get in here. Reach down. Those people are completely oblivious to this huge cart just going across the tracks. So there's a guy there. Two guards there, a guard there. Can I go in here? Nope. Hope that didn't work. Please don't come up here. There's this, this is the problem with dark vision is that you can't really see everything because you just see where people are. So I'm gonna try not to kill anybody, but I'm not gonna make any promises. Citizens and visitors to our city, by order of the region, the curfew is now active. No foot traffic is oh, allowed is across Caldwin's Bridge until curfew is Don't lifted. Here. Attention <laughs> all citizens, no pedestrian movement is allowed along Caldwin's Bridge during this period. Curfew will end tomorrow morning at sunrise. Okay, so that's not good. That was a kill. But he didn't alert any of the other guards, so it's good. Normally going in these houses is usually a pretty good idea because uh, there's not that many guards and stuff. There's that creepy noise. Oh, there's a moon right there. How am I going to get in there? Locked from the other side. So if I can get to the other side, runes and bone charms. Bone charms are like perks that give you a little bit more like a... Uh, this one, ha having your weapons out doesn't slow you, choking is faster, food heals you more, and then runes allow you to buy more powers. There's <coughs> one there, one there, and one over there. I do have sleep darts, which is like a ranged knockout, if this gets a little too difficult, but I'm gonna try... Oh, hey, look at this. Just thinking of what to do right now. Where'd that other guy go? Okay, so he found those bodies. So he is now a threat. By order of the region, the curfew is now stand up. No Do it, bro. Stand up. Is allowed across Caldwin's Bridge until curfew is lifted. Attention, all okay, citizens. So he's asleep. No pedestrian movement is allowed along Caldwin's Bridge during this period. Curfew will end tomorrow morning at sunrise. Oh, that was not what I wanted to do. Now he's asleep, he's in there. Did I not hit him? Yeah, he's asleep. <coughs> Come on, buddy. Let's go. So, maybe from here... There's a person over there. Looks like... Oh, my sword is in. <coughs> okay, so he's down. Oh, 
I want to go up there. Oh, there's another guy. He's walking. I don't want to go for it. It's bad to waste sleep darts because they're pretty hard to come by. And, uh... Yeah, nobody really uses them. So, nobody ever has them when they get d downed. Or dropped, or whatever. Okay. Ooh, there's people there. Dogs. The dogs are bad because the dogs can like smell you and stuff. Even a wealthy man like you needs the city watch. Might are cutting throats kill these guys left and right. And if I have to. Beepers, excuse me, plague victims are worse. Are you saying the Lord Regent is wrong for imposing curfew? It won't do you any good to bait me, officer. But don't worry, I'll be fine. I'll profit. Smart. Let's listen to what these guys say. Sure, like that Sokolov. He's doing fine. Always a lot of exotic items coming and going in his place. Keeps this place running, at least for now. Yes, yes, if by exotic you mean foul smelling as a witch's bottle. Okay, that was pretty sneaky. Sneaking by. Here's some. F oh no, that's not food, it's just copper wire. But yeah, you get money and you can buy. That thing. No, it's not. You get money and you can buy uh, upgrades and stuff. Oh, this is loud. But food will heal you, and that's helpful. Yeah, it's nice. There's a guy there. I just want to get up to the bridge. There's a person passed out there. And a person sitting down. I go up there. No, are they both passed out? Yep, they're both passed out. And one's dead. They're both dead. Oh, there's lots of guards. There's some gang members and a guard that's just gang. Those will shock you if you go near them. So it's bad. Okay. Some men mentioned that one of their friends got caught by the city watches in his cell somewhere nearby. Exact opposite of scout. Okay. He leaving? Are you, are you not leaving? What's going on? We saw the oh geez. They're still there. Those if you see those spinning that's bad. In case we want to go and get ourselves killed. Looks like Jack beat Quilty a lot. Is this Jack? It looks like we're gonna have to go the low route. Oh, we can go under here. Hmm. We'll see what's around this way first before we go over there. Somebody's yelling. Yeah, people are definitely yelling. Oh, that's it's unhelpful. A guard, two guards, a dog. This is just what's over here. But now I can come up from behind here. There's nobody over here. I'll write to her again. Guy in there. Is that it? I'm gonna use the sleep darts. This 
guy. Oh, that was... It's kind of hard because, uh... Left click is your knife, and right click is your gun, and that's opposite of, like, what hand they're in. So... Yeah, walk out real slow. And there you go. That thing, that thing scares me. I think... Look. Oh. So if I shoot that canister, will it blow up? Those dogs. That thing is bothering me. So this is just a normal bolt. That dog. Freak out. Dog, you're dead. Person. Sound the alarm. Oh man. Sound the alarm. Man, I can't deal with alarms. I'll find you. Ah, balls. So this is not good now. The alarm's been sounded. All sorts of things going on. I wonder if I can teleport on top of this thing. Ah, oh, that didn't work. Oop. So now they know that there's a bad guy in here, but I'm still trying to be pretty sneaky because they can't see me. There's a guy up there. There's two guys up there. Oh, this is going to be hard. I get on top of these things. Oh yeah, I can do this. The thing about guards in this game is they never look up. Like, ever. Can I get all the way up this? Nope. That's bothersome. I could go down under there, maybe. I can go in here. Okay, there's two guards in there. Oh dang. Oh dang, this is, this is bad. We're gonna use spring razors and uh This is sketchy. Okay. So he has two alert. We're gonna want that to go down before we go deal with him. Bro, calm down. Shoot him. Oh no, we don't even have to shoot him. He's choked out. This guy looks alone, but I think that arc. Yeah, we don't want that. So there's two people in here. Oh, I've got an idea. Yep, that worked. That guard is leaving, possibly. These guys. Since I don't want to ring the alarm, that's bad. He knows I'm here. Okay, he's coming down. We're gonna get our crossbow out. Actually, we're gonna. Okay. 
Come on, bro. Come down here. I'm not gonna hurt you. Actually, it's gonna hurt you a lot. Oh, where where are these people? Uh, where did these people come from? Oh, boss. No, that's not what I wanted. No, that's not what I wanted. Okay. That's not good. Ow. Ow, how did you... Okay, we're getting a pistol. Okay, that... Okay. We're gonna leave it with that, guys, because uh, I don't really feel like doing this again. See you next time.